This is the problem that I have with the dopamine detox. Now, I think that the dopamine detox definitely has the best intentions for people. And the idea of staying away from high dopamine activities to give your mind a break and to improve your life is definitely something that I would promote. But I think that a lot of people have a rather unrealistic image of what a dopamine detox should look like and that's probably because there are certain influences out there that give people the wrong idea. So for the dopamine detox to work, you only need to do it one day, one day. A lot of people seem to have gotten this idea that a dopamine detox is a temporary thing that you could do for like one day or something and that that is going to have any significant effects on your life. And this is just a mistake that I can very easily explain with this analogy. Try to think of it like this. Let's say that you are trying to lose weight and you are going to do so by going on a diet for, you've guessed it, one day. So you're gonna go on a diet for one day and then after that day, you're just gonna go straight back to your old habits of stuffing your face and eating exactly as much as you want to eat. Whenever someone tells you of this plan, the first thing you think is, what the f your problem is the fact that you eat too much food on a daily basis. So how on earth can you expect to just eat less food for one f***ing day and for that to be enough to see any significant weight loss in the long term, right? Well, it works the exact same way for the dopamine detox. The problem that you are having is the fact that you are living a lifestyle where you are constantly bombarding your brain with too much dopamine, porn, video games, social media, etc. And so you simply cannot expect to be able to step away from this lifestyle for one single day, or even two days, or even one week, but usually people talk about one day, and for that to be enough to have any significant positive changes on your brain in the long term. It it just doesn't work that way. I've done the dopamine detox plenty of times and I honestly think that it is a great habit. Yes, it is good for you. Yes, it does give your mind a break to some extent. You will feel a little bit more clear-headed. And I definitely think that a lot of people could benefit from incorporating this habit into their life every now and then. But again, you cannot expect this one day of so-called detoxing to make any significant changes to your life in the long term if you are not willing to make lifestyle changes as well. So what I suggest you do instead is that you start to make small changes to your actual lifestyle. Pick a pen and a piece of paper, sit down and ask yourself, don't ask me or anyone else, but ask yourself, what are small changes that I think are realistic for me to do right now, today? tomorrow, this week. So for example, it might be something simple, like tomorrow when I wake up, I am not going to check my phone before I'm gonna to go to work. I'm just gonna wake up, do my morning ritual, and gonna go straight to work. Or this week, I'm not gonna bring my phone with me to the bathroom when I have to go for a number two, or I'm only going to play my video games in the weekends and not during the weekdays. These are just examples. But ask yourself, what do you think are realistic habit changes that you can actually stick to and start doing right now? 